what's up you guys welcome back to my channel if you haven't already please subscribe down below turn on your post notifications so you can be notified every time i post a new video and for today's video i just want to have a chit chat um update you guys of my breastfeeding experience and i am so far been breastfeeding for about eight months straight I told myself when I was pregnant that I was going to be breastfeeding for at least six months and so far I have been breastfeeding seems to be full term no formula the first three months of breastfeeding is extremely tiring trying to get the hang of it and you're you know since the baby's so small you're mostly slouching your back or having to pick up the baby up here to breastfeed after a while of breastfeeding i don't mean to be holding my baby for so long but in the first five months i felt like my baby was getting like embrasilada where her dependence was pretty much on me really once i think she was about five months christmas came so for christmas my mom ended up buying gifting gifting my baby That really helped because she um that would get her tired and entertained and that's one of those things that I learned that that babies do get bored just like we do just like just like anybody it's kind of like hello I'm right here pay attention to me so that's kind of she would cry just um to be held but with the gifts my mom gave we had we had already bought a high chair and then for Christmas do you like it my mom gifted me like one of those little play chairs for the babies to sit on you could either put it on the I'll be showing a picture right here somewhere chair she actually started to um, be more independent because like if I'm sitting in the table I could put her in front of me it was just a lot of ways to do it and then there was like little play things and then I would hang up all the toys for her to play so she was being a lot like more independent so and then now when probably like after a month having her with her little play area pretty much getting her entertained is what helped her be more independent and i will be able to go to the store without her screaming and crying in the car and it just she knew already like when she sits in the car seat she knows that we're either going somewhere it might take a little while and stuff like that but she is a completely more independent but then probably around six months the teething phase came so once the teething phase came it's like um everything like as soon as everything was getting better there's always another thing so and then she was teething and crying her teeth hurted so and then it seemed there was just i think like a week where she was teasing extremely bad moral of the story that she became more independent because because i gave her like little activities for a eight month year old baby i feel like she has a lot of toys i even feel like buying her different more kinds of toys just to keep her continuously entertained i'll see you guys once i get home okay so my baby's currently taking a nap and i'm going to be starting on my meal prep and i normally do this one, the first thing in the morning on Monday morning just, I'm just going to be showing you guys what I do and then continue talking to you guys about pretty much uh, my baby and just any updates that I could remember and it was just sharing my experience and so let's get started with meal prepping can we take a moment and see how cute this um cantarito is my cuñada gifted me this and it's so cute I'm so ready to make another drink video that's gonna be obviously you know how to make rice but hopefully i can motivate anybody um to meal prep just because it i always wash my rice when i'm gonna steam it just because we can remove all the extra starch you see all that white stuff that's all extra starch for every one cup of rice i use two cups of water so look how clear it looks now now that i washed my rice ready ready to eat carrots that are gonna place it in this bowl and i'm gonna rinse it while the rice is cooking it's also steaming the carrot so it's like a two-in-one thing okay so while my rice and carrots are getting cooked i'm gonna start with the meats for today's meal prep i'm going to be using chicken breast ground beef and 
steak for today's um, this week's meal prep and then I'm going to be using the grill to cook the chicken and the steak and I'm going to be using a propane grill well even though it seems like a lot of cooking today it's gonna it makes the whole week so much easier it's just one day that it's just gonna be cooking and for t what I normally do is the chicken breast eat it on Monday so the chicken is eaten fresh definitely my go-to for chicken breast it, it makes it taste so delicious and has so much flavor seasoning the chicken with buttery steakhouse wood fire garlic and some black pepper so this is how it should look all right so for the steak i'm actually going to be using some honey garlic garlic jalapeno of course some black pepper sorry all right so my rice and steamed carrots are ready i just lift it up this is my baby roast lint and if you're breastfeeding you could always put them right here and then breastfeed but for the purpose of this video i'm going to be facing her forward and then gonna put her feet inside and then And voila, we're done. Oh, I have my baby with me. Say hi, mama. Hey. And then this is to cover the sun. But I decided to face her forward so she could, you know, pretty much be outside. But let's get back to cooking. Right now I have the chicken and the steak right here. I might end up just um putting my baby down to play while I finish cooking just because I have a lot to do today. I'm going to put her down to play with her little with her brother because I need to move a little faster and having her hold it I feel like I'm just kind of you know doing everything a little more slower and then I started the baby led weaning which is where the babies are eating on their own and eating that eating actual food from their hands in a bit before um, I forget I wanted to talk about uh, my the whole reason why I wanted to do this breastfeeding um, breastfeeding update was because for some reason they from what I would thought is breastfeed 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 and all the weight is just gonna fall off and so in the beginning when I was breastfeeding I was eating a lot because I thought oh I'm going to uh, lose it anyways I'm full-time breastfeeding everything is just gonna fall off and so that just was not the case for me I felt like I was not losing no weight obviously I feel more excessively tired because I'm breastfeeding I'm pumping I'm breastfeeding but I was not losing the weight and then when I was and then I'm like I cannot lose any like I'm not losing any weight like I've been on a diet and then I was losing my milk and it was just like a back and forth process but I finally found a balance when actually when I had lost when I was doing the fasting diet um, my milk was like drying up I wasn't having enough milk and um, once I went back to eating a little bit more normal right now the only thing I do I the only difference of a diet that I do now is I eat a breakfast I probably eat a toast avocado or just egg or maybe a, a shake like nothing and then and then I'll eat my meal prep in the day maybe ever since I started eating a little more healthy I feel um, like I'm losing weight but when they told me oh you're gonna be losing all these calories you're gonna be losing all this weight like the whole point of me making this video was just to tell you guys about even though I was breastfeeding I thought I was gonna lose all the weight and unfortunately that just wasn't the way it went for me personally and now that I'm actually like in a diet eating salads and merch just around the corner so also meal prep it was the go-to meal little talk but see and I'm gonna be showing you guys the finished product of my meal prep product and here I have my chicken breast, my steak, I have the um, steamed carrots, 
steamed rice. And this is the first time we're going to be eating ground beef. So I did it with onions and mushroom. Obviously, I'm going to take the most I can of the excess uh, grease. This is the first time I'm going to be doing the ground beef. And yeah, so today we're going to be eating salad. So to be prepping the food and then we should be set for at least another three days helps me with not having to cook during the week it's just a lot of benefits hopefully i could encourage any of you guys to meal prep your food and to be honest it makes life so much easier so so here we have the steak and rice steamed rice with steamed carrots and the ground beef onion and mushroom with steamed rice and carrots already prepared and if you enjoyed my video please give this video a big thumbs up and thank you so much for watching steph's life channel